God bless you all. Welcome to another video. Today we are going to be talking about the dangers of mocking God. And brothers and sisters, we live in a world that a lot of people mock God. We take God's name in vain. We, you know, we make fun of the name of Jesus Christ. Even in the Bible, those, you know, who crucified Christ, they, you know, they mocked his name. They mocked for who the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords is. And, you know, grieving the Holy Spirit today. You know, making fun of God's name, making fun of, you know, his word, you know, the Bible, making fun of his holy word, his living word. You know, we could, but we have seen so many things, right, in such a society of today, of Christ, literally, you know, he, he's always working, you know what I mean? But, like, we have seen things on camera. It's not that we believe by sight. But even with things people have seen, we still not believe and we're still not changing. For example, there's a clip of, of you know, of a woman who fell on stage uh, a couple months ago. And many things like the TV shows today that we take God's name in vain, we mock God, you know. Uh, God's name is holy and, you know, just breaking that one thing, you're breaking a one of the commandments of the Ten Commandments that says, do not take the, the, the Lord's name in vain, for whoever does shall not go on goatee. So, you know, it's a very scary thing how, you know, we're in a place, in a society that we feel comfortable in sin. We feel comfortable in such a lifestyle that it's not healthy, it's, it's not good, it's really evil, really bad. And I just want us to pray. You know, just for, for everyone, for everything. And just to keep on spreading the gospel no matter where you are, who you are. Uh, you know, don't look at the numbers of the subscribers. Don't look at the number of views. Just to go and spread the gospel. We're spreading the gospel for the glory of God. For Christ to speak to people. Being led by the Holy Spirit. So, brothers and sisters, today. God is telling you to go spread his gospel. But God is also telling you to have a relationship with the Lord. Because we can't be preaching to other people. We're not having a relationship with God. Then right there, it'll be hypocrisy. You know, the Pharisees in the Bible was acting like that. They were trying to put one a piece of a picture when God knew the whole canvas of how their hearts were. And you see, God, that, God is still like that today. God sees the whole image of our heart. So brothers and sisters, today, just remember, repent for the kingdom of heaven is near. Repent of your ways, it says in the word, the wages of sin is stiff, but the gift of God is eternal life through Jesus Christ. So remember, brothers and sisters, there is life in Christ Jesus and death in this world that's temporary. You know, in this world, you know, all the sexual morality, all the power, all the, you know, self-ego, you know, all these things, brothers and sisters, it's all meaningless. But with Christ Jesus, everything is everlasting everything it's love joy peace in christ jesus even through the tribulations and problems we have victory through christ jesus so brothers and sisters spread the gospel share this video with other people so the word keeps on going spread the word and just know that god is with each one of us you know, each one of you god bless each one of you and remember jesus loved you